Hey y'all, this is me, Madness, back with another video. Uh, today we're going to be doing a little craft that I found on Pinterest. Um, we're going to take a picture frame, paint it, and then we're going to decorate it. We're going to put these uh, round Christmas ornaments. Got some with glitter and some without. Um, I'm going to hang probably three three or four inside from a piece of string from the top of the frame, letting them hang down inside the frame. And then I'm going to, um, those are going to fall. Okay. Then what I'm going to do, I need to set those right there. Uh, then what I'm going to do is take my little drums, a few of my little drums and a few of my little presents, and I'm going to put them around the outside. And then at the top of the frame, I'm going to take my burlap um, ribbon with snowflakes on it, make a big bow at the top, and then this is the, this sparkly blue color is just going to be an accent kind of thing. Okay, so that's what we're doing. Um, I did not take out. <laughs> Forgot to take out these little things real quick. Little things that hold the glass in the frame. I forgot to take out, so I got to do that real quick. Now that I've got those up. Okay, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and paint my frame real quick. Oh, my eyes itching, y'all. Okay, I'm going to paint my frame real quick, so I'm going to be quiet, okay? Okay, y'all, I've got that done. Uh, here it is. I'll show y'all. Y'all can see that. Painted the front and the back side of it. Um, I nicked a couple places, so I'm going to have to fix those real quick. But that worked really well. So I'm going to fix these, this one place right here. And then I'll get to going on. Okay. After I do this, y'all, the next step I'm going to do, I'm going to add glitter to mine because right now it's just a little plain flat blue color. Um, so I'm going to add some silver glitter to it. Okay. Let me get these little spots. Alright, fix that. Okie dokie. So now what I'm going to do, after I close this so I don't spill it, I'm going to get, I've got some craft glue. Sorry. Got craft bond right here. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to um, squirt a strip of it down each side and kind of um, smear it with the paintbrush. And then I'm going to sprinkle it with the, the glitter. I'm going to do one piece at a time just so that it doesn't dry on me. So, time to be quiet and let y'all watch. Okay, y'all, I finally finished that. I had to break out the blow dryer to dry the paint and the glue, but I've got my glitter all around it, and of course I made a glitter mess. I've got glitter everywhere. So, now next step is to move this water before I dump it, first of all. <laughs> That would be very bad. I don't think um, Tin Man would be too happy if I did that. So, okay. Uh, next step is to start um, to hot glue my presents, my drums, and a couple bells around the outside of it. Uh, you can use whatever you like. Um, I found these. This all, all of this 
uh, the presents, the drum, the bells, the fabric, um, the burlap ribbon, and the blue ribbon all came from the Dollar Tree. All were a dollar. And then um, the glitter also came from the Dollar Tree. It was a dollar. Uh, the craft bond we've had, but we got it at Walmart, and I think it was like $3 for this little bottle. Um, but we use it for all this kind of stuff. So, okay. Just open all of these. And I am only going to use the blue and the silver that are in here, each of the, each of the presents in the drawer. I'm going to show you a few bells out. And y'all, these are ornaments that go on the Christmas tree. But like I said, I'm fixing to repurpose them, as people in the craft industry say. In the DIY industry. See, I got red and gold left. And that's what will be left in here, red and gold. smaller presents and drums. Of course, I didn't get those. That would have been too perfect. Uh, so, anyway. Alright, I'm going to cut the little... Now, the presents, I don't think they were actually meant for deck for the tree for ornaments. Just says, well, I guess it does say ornaments, so I don't know, but they don't have the little string on them. Anyway. Cut the little string off. There we go. Okay, I've got my hot glue gun. I've had it on uh, so that it would be ready to go. Okay, so there's the top of it right here. So now what we're going to do, take our glue gun and put it on there. Press it on there for a minute. Make sure it's sticking. And you don't have to paint your picture frame. If you like it the way it is, leave it that way. Again, these are your projects. You do not have to do the exact same thing that I do. I would absolutely love for y'all to send me your projects and your DIYs that you're working on, your crafts. Uh, send me a picture or a video of them. Okay, I'll do this one right here. And there was only three, three drums of each. Three blue, three silver. And as y'all know, blue is my favorite favorite color, most favorite color in the world. So that's why I'm doing mine in blue. Oh, there was four silver presents. Hmm. Okay. So only, oh no, there was three. Y'all, I'm losing my mind. Really, I am. Okay, so got those on there. Okay. Try to get these strings off, y'all. Sorry. Okay, so now what I'm going... Oh, I forgot the bells, y'all. The best part. Okay. I'm not going to put very many because, like I said, I don't want to overwhelm it. putting like five more y'all. Okay. So, there's that. Okay. Got that on there. Oh. And strings from the glue gun. It's killing me. 
Okay, now what I'm going to do is get my presents that I didn't use out of the way. And get my burlap so that I can make my bow that's going to go on here. Oh, you guys, you know what I did? Y'all know what I did? Oh, no. I've messed up, y'all. I wasn't supposed to put the drums or the bells on the top. Because that's where my bow was supposed to go. Okay, we're going to fix it, though. So, let me shut y'all off while I figure out what to do, okay? I'll be back. Okay, y'all, I fixed it. Uh, what I did is I took the two bells that I put up here off. They came off easy. The drum on the, uh oh, y'all didn't see that. The two bells I had up here, the drum on the other hand did not want to come off. So I actually broke the drum and left the bottom piece on there, which I can hide behind my bow. So now for the bow, I'm going to set this to the side for just a second. Okay. Oh, first I've got to do the, the ornaments, the balls inside of it. Okay, so, uh, like I said, all of this, these came from the dollar store, a dollar tree, they were a dollar. And of course it's going to give me trouble. I'm gonna put one, two, I'm gonna put four in there, y'all, okay? Um, two of the glitter, one glitter blue, one glitter silver, and then one non-glitter blue and non-glitter silver, okay? These are just the shiny ones. Um, your blue ribbon or my blue ribbon actually whatever color ribbon you have you want to get one of the wide um, ribbon burlap whatever you want you want to get one wide roll of wide one roll of wide and then you want to get a roll of the thin um, this is actually a little bit thicker than I wanted it but I think it's going to do okay. So what you're going to do is you're going to take your ribbon. Okay, I'm just going to cut a big strip of it off. Okay, set it to the side. Now, what you want to do is you're going to hang these at varying uh, lengths. Like you want to put one up here one down here, put another one a little bit further down, and then put the other one like there, okay? Just so that they're at varying distances from each other, like they're not all, they're not all up on top of each other is what I'm trying to say, y'all, okay? So, but actually I want these two which, let's see. There we go. That's the way we do it. Our. I'm such an idiot, y'all. Maybe that's why they only have three. Okay, y'all. I'm only going to put three. Okay. I'm going to put the two silvery ones. Or the two glitter ones. And then the one uh, shiny. I'll get it out in a minute, y'all. I'm so sorry. My mind's just not working. Okay, so you want to measure from the top how far down you want, and then you're going to cut your ribbon. You're going to double how long you want it. 
okay? And then you're going to take your ribbon, you're going to put it through your, uh, wait a minute. No, y'all. Changing the ornaments up. I'm going to do the glittery ones. And a shiny one. So like that. Okay, so we got that. Okay, so now you're going to take your ribbon. Uh-oh. And this is why you wanted it to be a little bit thinner than what this is, because you have to put it through your ornament. So, I'm going to strip this piece of ribbon in half. Now we're going to put this through here. And if you don't want to use the ribbon, um, you can use um, string, uh, fishing wire, or fishing line, uh, anything like that will work, okay? So, now I've got my ornament on there, and I've got my two uh, pieces in pieces and what I'm going to do with these is first I'm going to um, hot glue them together at the top Cut that off straight. okay so I'm going to put just a dot of hot glue in between the two of them the two pieces of ribbon and then um, glue the top piece together Okay, leave the other open. Okay, now what you're going to do is you're going to take your frame, turn it like this, and then you're going to glue the two pieces of um, the piece of ribbon. You're going to hot glue it to the actual frame itself on the inside. Okay, just like this. I'll put it right down, right there okay and then I'm going to take this and just lay it on there push it down a little bit don't burn yourself in the process because I burnt myself so bad the other day that my finger actually blistered okay And then it's going to hang down just like that. Okay. Put mine a little bit close to the edge, but that's okay. You'll see it dangling. Okay. Next, you're going to get your next ornament, which is going to be my silver one wherever I put it. Right there in front of my face. Okay. And then I'm going to. I want it to hang down a lot further than that one. I want it to hang pretty close to the bottom. So, okay, so there's the second one. And then the third one I'm going to hang about right here. So I need just a little short piece of string. Okay, y'all, there's that part done. Now the next step is to make the bow. Um, so that's what I'm fixing to do. I'm fixing to make the bow. I'm gonna set this to the side. Okay, y'all. It is finito. Uh, I hope y'all like this craft. I hope y'all might try this. Please send me your pictures, your videos. I will feature it on my channel. Um, 
Again, I found this on Pinterest. Y'all can go look at Pinterest. Um, and be sure to subscribe. Hit that like button. Share this video with your friends and family, please. And as always, thank y'all for being here. And I will see y'all next time. Bye, y'all.